Good morning, modern steaders. Oh, look at those leaves. They make a nice backdrop for you there, Andy. <laughs> we gotta go check on the chickens in New York City. Make sure no skunks got in there. I'm not looking forward to that, but I also don't know how they got in there the night before. I have an idea, but I'm hoping they're not back in there this morning. They don't want the chickens near their food. <laughs> now the turkeys were acting weird yesterday and I think it was because they knew something was in New York City that wasn't supposed to be there. We don't need Pluto to find a skunk either. All right, so I'm still seeing the eggs that were left out last night, so that's a good sign. So that means nothing was in here eating them. This is the scary part. This is where they were hiding. Nope, no skunks. Whew. Wow, I don't know if somebody laid an egg over here yesterday or if that was brought out by a skunk. Hmm. And it definitely smells skunky right here. <coughs> Moose, is there any skunks in there with you? Hope not. Still smells a little skunky. This chicken has a worm. Can you see it? All the other chickens want it. What are you doing, Figaro? Figaro. What are you doing? Well, the eggs that were in New York City with the skunk, we ain't gonna eat. Let the pigs have them. That was one of the things Olivia asked me last night when I put her to bed. Dad, are the skunks gone? I'm like, yeah. Did you collect the eggs? I said, no. She's like, are we going to keep them? I said, no. She's like, are we going to feed them to the pigs? I said, yes. She said, good. And Gina's like, yeah, they're not coming in the house. In yesterday's video, me and Olivia went to do the afternoon chores, and we found some skunks. If you didn't see that video, I'll put a link to it right here. Yeah, it was quite the adventure. And then I was working on the new goat area and I'll be getting back in there in a little bit and clearing out some more brush and trees so we can get this area. Well, let's just get to work. When me and Olivia were out the other day taking the drone footage of all the fall foliage, we came across this pretty cool piece of driftwood. Not sure what I'm gonna do with it, but I couldn't leave it down at the reservoir. If you flipped it around, you could probably use it as a hat or a coat hanger. Not sure Gina's gonna want that in the house. But I couldn't leave it, that's pretty cool. Figure I better touch up the chainsaw. She's pretty dull from the last time we used her.
don't let me forget that there. I'll be pretty discouraged if I ruin it. I'm very happy with the first initial rough grade over here in the new goat area. Once it dries out a little bit, I'll be able to rake it out and get it seeded up. It's supposed to rain tomorrow, so I'm hoping to get all this brush and trees cut down, and then we can burn it tomorrow, and then maybe Friday or next week, we can get in there and get this area all roughed up and make it look like this. have to get in there with the excavator and pull that one over. You guys see that? Chain's riding high. Came off the track somewhere. Better go fix it. Just a minor setback. No big deal. There, sitting back in the groove. I'll just tighten it up and make the chain tension a little tighter. Much nicer. a huge mess let's see if we can have the excavator help us out and get some of the bigger trees out in a safer area to cut up
notes to rain and apples. Want that tree to go that way. <laughs> This apple tree right here, but let me show you. See, somebody dug out a stump right here, and that's gonna that's telling me that that root ball was disturbed, and that tree's gonna die. Otherwise, I'd be tempted to keep that tree because it's not a bad tree. <laughs> goats up for this one. Hello. Go ahead, get in. You stay. One more to go. Come on, we're almost got it. Gotcha. I don't want to fall a tree on you. There's a bunch of apples over there too, girls. All right. Fingers crossed. Dear Lord, please cover us in your safety. We don't want to get hurt or destroy any buildings. Amen. Booyah! Gotcha. All right. We got that cleaned up and taken care of. Set this there. And I want to get the excavator out of this hole for tomorrow. And then I'll work my way back in here. As I'm cleaning brush and stuff out. We're saving all of them. They're in good shape. I shouldn't say good shape. They're in decent shape. We need to prune them up. And then, in here, we got some more stumps to dig and pull. Hopefully, tomorrow we can do that. Got a big old mess 
of down cut up trees. <sighs> but my goal with that is it's supposed to be raining tomorrow. So this way at least it's cut up. I can have a fire going and I can start dragging stuff and I don't gotta run the chainsaw in the rain. I hope it pays off tomorrow. I guess we'll find out. I got brush everywhere. What do you got there? An art project. An art project, what is it? Um, it's a stable. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I like it. You ready to go collect the eggs? No skunks, hopefully. Mm -hmm. well, you can do it. Look at your foolish dog. They'll come back. Now back up a little bit. Come on, Pluto, this way. They'll eat it. Yeah. He steps where we step. Mm -hmm. Funny. They say we want some food. Wow. Oh. You ready to try this again today? No eggs, no skunks. They probably laid in the coop. There's one egg. Is there? There's. <gasps> what? Moose was running. Oh, I thought you saw a skunk. No. No. I don't see any eggs. They're all in that corner. I'm not videotaping you taking the hay out. Oh, there's five boxes. For some reason, I always felt like there was four. Well, well, the chickens laid in a corner, and it still kind of stinks in New York City. So we're not bringing them in the house. We'll let the pigs have some more eggs. Now oh, it's probably close to a dozen, and a couple of double yolkers. Mm -hmm. You want some eggs, huh? Have some eggs. We get sick. We get fire sick. Well, I think the chickens deserve some new hay for their nesting boxes. I think the chickens kind of earn this after having those nasty, stinky things in their house. Phew. Still stinks in here a little bit. Put in some pork.
We'll add in our rice. Smells so good. Now that was a sticky noise. Alright guys, it's time to go see if we got any skunks in the chicken coop tonight. <sighs> I hope not. Keep your eyes out. Oh, did you see the deer? Right there. Just one. All right, I gotta herd the turkeys first. You know the drill. One more, let's go. Good job. smell anything. Whew. Only chickens. Whew. That's a relief. I'm gonna go milk Willow, so this is where we're gonna end today's video, and we'll see you right back here in the next one. Bye.